I really should tidy my locker someday. Aw, Kevin, you shouldn't have. Uh, I didn't. Let go. They're beautiful. Oops. How are you so strong? Never mind. Gotta go. Kevin? Hey, Jasmine. These are for you. Aw, you're so sweet. Can I walk you to class? I didn't like those flowers anyway! Wait, this gives me an idea. I'll show them. I need this glue stick. I'll run it over my eyebrows. It's just like using an eyebrow pencil. Except stickier. Okay, that should do it. Next, I need this makeup palette. I'll brush the makeup on top of the glue. I want to cover it completely. That's just what I want. Now I'll apply white makeup to my cheeks. This makeup sponge gives an even and smooth application. I just need to dab it on. Then I'll do the same on my forehead. And around my neck, throat, and chest. That should be enough. Next, I need darker foundation. It's just like contouring. This will give a contrast to the white makeup. It's looking good! Now it's time for some gray. I'll go over the same spots as the darker foundation. It'll create shadowing. But I'm not finished. This blue is perfect for around my eyes. I'll follow the natural curve and draw a thin line. Just like this. I'll put black eyeshadow on the lower lids. I'm almost ready. There's just one last thing. Kevin's flowers. I'll gently squeeze the flower to separate the petals. Now I can paint it. I'll apply blue paint to the bottom of the petal, then work my way up. Once that's dry, I'll add black paint. I won't go as far up the petal this time. Next, I need white paint. This can go around the ends. It looks so pretty! Now I need to apply it to my face. I'll position it and then carefully press it onto my skin. I need a few more. All that's missing is the finishing touches. Some fake blood. I'll use a pipette to make it drip from my eyes. Pretty impressive, huh? I hope Kevin likes it. And then I was like, back off, Cheryl. It was so funny. Uh, Kevin? Who's that? Huh? What are you talking about? Hello, Kevin. I've been looking for you. Why did you leave? We belong together. For eternity. Uh, stay back. I, I mean it. Whoa! Oh, Kevin. Don't be like that. You're so silly. Uh, leave me alone! Take Jasmine instead! Do something, Jasmine! Ugh. I love your dress. And your makeup. Thanks. I did it myself. Wanna hang out? Yeah. Let's get out of here. He's so immature. Phew. That was close. I, I mean, I wasn't scared. Wait. What was that noise? Someone's behind me, aren't they? Hello, Kevin. Ugh, could this get any less interesting? And that's why I call it the cotton candy brick. Sales are projected to soar by February. Are any of these people listening to me? Five out of ten. Ooh. Hmm. I know. Start by cutting the face in half. With a white makeup pencil. Then move on to the forehead. Now, fill in the top third with white makeup. This may take a couple of minutes. And perhaps more than one coat. Then move on to the bottom section. And now is where the fun starts. Here we go! The pink on one side, and the blue on the other. Yellow goes around the nose. And keep blending till you get to the neck. Great! Now put some white on a brush. And draw cute little clouds. They can be different sizes, too. Don't forget about the neck. A little gloss on the lips is great to finish it off. Isn't it pretty? You didn't think I'd leave the keys plain, did ya? Whoa! Those white contacts really make this a look. Now, ahem! Can I continue? Whoa! You've gotta see this! Well done! Glad something got your attention. And now it's time to get a lot more. Bring it in. You've gotta taste it to believe it. Mmm. Sweeter than sweet. Huh? Awesome! Mom, look! And he was totally scared of me. 
nothing says a fun Saturday afternoon like sitting around and painting. And we chose fabulous colors this time. The pinks and blues and purples go so well together. But what can I add to this thing? Um, watch where you fling that thing. Uh, sorry. Hmm. Wait, I know! <gasps> Your brush! Oops, my bad. Ugh. Hold it! Ugh, fine. This stuff better not be permanent. Phew. It was just an accident. Wait a minute. I have the most brilliant idea! Come on! Oof. Take me out of this world! Well, with some makeup anyway. And the brows are the first order of business. Now for the first shapes. Some intergalactic shapes, that is. Looks kinda funny at the beginning. Oh, what's that? Hey, you gotta prime this stuff. It'll make the color look better. Even on this little one. Now that the primer's on, let's paint! Wow! Awesome! To give this big guy some depth, shade the outer edge with black. Then blend in a bright blue hue. Then some magenta on the other side. The key to this is blending very well. No matter how many colors you use. Then outline the planet with white. And make sure the white is thick enough. Looks fabulous so far. Once that's finished, blend a light layer of white in the surrounding space. And once you do all that, you can start using blue over here. Be sure to close your eyes for this part. You can even put on some purple. Ooh, check out that gorgeous turquoise. That'll really make your eyes pop. Along with some neon. Be sure not to neglect the lips. Remember this little planet? It deserves a little shading action, too. Black and white can go well together. Same with this planet over here. Ooh, check out that purple! Then round it out with a little white. Lips are done! Center the chin with some yellow. Whoa! Now that's some magenta! You sure all these colors go together? Well, as long as you blend well, they always will go well together. And then you can focus on the littlest of details. Use white to make all kinds of things. Don't be afraid to get creative with it. Add some more colors, too, if you want. The more space you have, the better. You have a whole galaxy to work with. You didn't think we'd forget about the neck, did you? Use a makeup sponge to cover more ground. And it blends easier that way, too. Well, what do you think? Add a new do and watch out, world! It's just beautiful, isn't it? It's like traveling through outer space without ever leaving Earth! Oh, wow! I'm happy now! Shall we continue? Okay, so for my next picture, I… Annie! I'm sorry! Oh, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Ugh. Do any of these pieces go together? Maybe if I push them together harder. Does this work? No. How about this? It's worse. Mom? Huh? Maybe this? Am I losing my mind? How about this? What? This is hopeless! Ow! My puzzle! This could've really hurt me! Oh? Wait a minute! I got it! Let's piece this look together! First, I need white face paint. I'll run the brush over it and then apply it to my face. This will be my base coat, so it just needs to be a light coating. But I don't want to miss any spots. Now I'll use a darker foundation. I'll use this to create a contouring effect. I'll go over my cheekbones and around my nose. I'll also use it under my eyes. It'll look great! Okay, now for the next part. I'll cut the soda can in half. I'll hold it against my forehead. And use a makeup pencil to trace around it. 
Next, I need a bowl of glue and some toilet paper. I'll dip the toilet paper into the glue and then place it on my forehead. I want to shape it around the soda can outline. I'll do the same on the other side. I want to make sure it's raised up off the skin. Pinching it will help get the desired effect. Now I need the soda can again. I'll push it into the toilet paper. Once it's dry, I can paint it with makeup. I want it to match my skin tone. I'll just go over it, building up the layers of makeup. Once that's done, I can add fake blood. I'll use a brush for this. I'll put it around the edge of the toilet paper and the can. This way, it'll look like a wound. It's fine if there's some drips. It just makes it look more realistic. Which is what I want, right? I can dab some red makeup around the can and toilet paper. And I'm finished. I'm ready to prank Cheryl. This will teach her not to drink my soda. Come here, Teddy! I need hugs! Jasmine was mean to me. I'm gonna tell mommy. You'll be in so much trouble. Take that! Huh? Don't ignore me when I'm throwing things at you! Do you hear me? <sighs> I need something bigger. This'll do. Ugh, you deserve this! Ow! That hurt! Uh, are you okay? Uh, Jasmine? Uh-oh, that doesn't look good. Uh, what? What happened? Jasmine, I'm sorry! I've got a really bad headache. What the? What's wrong? Uh, it's… Ah! <laughs> got her. I knew that would work. Now I can finish my game. I think that's everything. I'm ready to open for business. Oh hey! Do you want to buy some candy or a soda? Uh, no way. That's okay. There will be other customers. I hope. Oh, excuse me, sir. See anything you like? Huh? How about a delicious ice cream? You look like you have a sweet tooth. Stop pointing that at me. I really thought that would be a sale. This isn't going well. Uh, hello? Oh, hi. Look at this tasty treat! I've got different flavors! Cute, but I'm not interested. I've gotta go. What am I doing wrong? I'm starting to think this was a bad idea. Wait a minute. I have an idea. I just need a gimmick. And a new look. I'll draw a line with this makeup pencil. This is fun! I'll do the same on my throat and chest. I'm creating an outline. Okay, now for the next part. I have this bright pink makeup. I'll brush it onto my face. But I need to stay within the outline. I need to apply it e Just gotta file my nails a bit. And now it's time for a great prank. Hey! Check out my toenails! Oh, looks like I have too many toes. Better fix that. Hold it right there. Stop. Sir, come forward, please. <laughs> Unimpressive! You can go in. Ugh, I can't believe they let that unicorn in, but not me! Wait, is she a nurse? Oh, I get it. I gotta change. Time for some makeup. I'll start with this black and a brush. It's so dark. I'll put it on my eyelids. I want to make sure I coat them nice and good. Okay, that should do it. Next steps. I'm gonna use this red eyeliner pencil and line my lower lid with it. It doesn't have to be too much. Just a touch. And now more black on my lower lid. The black requires a bit of work to make it dark enough. And now it's time for my mouth. I'll just draw a circle around my lips. And now I'll dip this tissue in some costume glue. Okay, that should be enough. I'll stick it right here on my chin. I'll make sure it's gonna stay in place. Now I need some more, and I'll put it along the line I drew. All the way up to the top of my lips, too. Just gotta finish the rest of the circle. There we go. It's starting to dry. And now to fill in the space with more black. My lips, too. Everything inside the tissues. There. It's nice and black. And now for some fake teeth. I made these by taking fake nails and trimming them into shape. 
nice and sharp and pointy. And I'll put them on the tissue. On the top and bottom for both sets of teeth. This is gonna turn out so good. I just know it! Time for more makeup! I need a foundation that matches my skin tone now. I want to make sure the tissue is blended nicely. Now to add some fake blood on the fake teeth. Gotta make sure I do the bottom teeth, too. This is looking so good! I'll add some more fake blood by dabbing the sponge. It's gonna look a little like blood spray, I think. Just little dabs all around should go far. Okay, now I'll touch up some more fake blood drips. I'll draw some drip marks down my throat. But I'll also let it drip on its own, too. Yes! I'm finally done! My creepy look is complete! Add in a fun costume, and I'm gonna rock it! There's that security guard who wouldn't let me in before. Huh? Who's that over there? Time to get into the club. What? Another nurse costume? Really? Actually, I'm more than just a nurse. Oh my gosh! That's terrifying! I'm out of here! They're not paying me enough for this! See you later. I'll let myself in. Any room for a witch? Come on in. Yes! <laughs> if you let me in, I promise I'll be good. On you go. Bless you. This will be a great night! Whoa, what are you, a scary strawberry? Nope, you can't come in. That's so not fair! Steady, steady, look out! Are you okay? Look at this, my boss will be mad. Sorry, let me help. Oh hey, these nails could be useful. Can I have them? Sure. First, take some face paint. Then stick some tissue paper to it. Then cover it all with more face paint. Carefully cut a hole where your mouth is. Use some black face paint to color your lips. No scary costume would be complete without blood. Then gently push the nails through the tissue paper. And... <sighs> A simple scary costume. Time to go to the nightclub. Can I come in now? Hey, what did I tell you? No fruit allowed. Oh... How about... Ah! Ah! Mommy! <laughs> I guess I can go in. Ah! I have a great idea for costume. I'll draw a curvy line across my chest. Then I'll paint it with brown and white stripes. Next, I need orange makeup, but not too much. I'll add shadowing to my eyes. Now let's add the scare factor. I'll use a thin brush for this part. You weren't expecting that, were you? Let's get some candy. Hello? Aw, look at you! Hi, lady. That's so adorable. Wait, right there. I've got some delicious candy for you. Here you go, sweetie. You can put it in this basket. Something wrong. I'm out of here! It's raining candy! This is so cool! <laughs> it's my lucky day! Nothing can ruin this! Ouch! I spoke too soon. Ooh, that had to hurt. Ugh. How long is this song? I feel like I've been dancing to it all night. Ugh, this is boring. I need a break. I'm gonna sit down. Phew, that's better. I thought this would be more fun. This gum has lost all its flavor. I think it's done. I'll just put it here. Oh, I have an idea. I'll make a work of art. Huh? Hey! Hmm. What's the big idea? It's a masterpiece. Huh? Look at this. Get rid of it. What's the problem? You always do this. I need to teach you a lesson. 
I'll place a cotton pad over my eye and secure it with a piece of adhesive plastic. Now I need to hide it. First, I'll apply some latex glue. I'll let that dry. That should do it. Then I'll cover it with makeup. I'll use a makeup sponge for this. This'll give me an even application. I don't want to miss any spots. Now I need a pen. I'll use this to draw an eyebrow. I want it to be realistic. That looks great. Next, I'll put some eyeshadow on. I want it to match my other eye. So I'll use the same colors. That's perfect. Then I'll add fake eyelashes. I'll put it slightly lower on my face. It needs to look like my eye is closed. Now I can peel the plastic back. But not all the way. I'll need a red makeup pencil. I'll follow the curve of my eye. I want to draw along the side of my nose. And down to the bottom of my cheek. I'll fill it in with red makeup. I'll paint around my eye. But only the part that's showing. Now I can add some fake blood. This is looking gory. And that's just what I want. Now I can put the plastic back down. I'll brush more fake blood over the edge of it. I think that's it. Everything looks normal. And then this happens. Pretty scary, huh? Let's go and show Betty. Ahem. Excuse me. Huh? What is it, nerd? You're so annoying. We need to talk. It's about the gum. Ah! Is something wrong? I'll clean it up. See? Look! <laughs> How's that? Please leave me alone. Hmm. Let me see that. Yeah, that'll do. It's much better. Sometimes things go bump in the night. But there's nothing to worry about. That's just us thinking of awesome Halloween costumes. What was your favorite? Let us know in the comments below. Remember to share this video with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more frightfully good videos just like this one. This is so relaxing. A cute little pumpkin. What was that? Probably nothing. He hello? Who's there? <laughs> Got you! That was so funny. That's not cool. Aha! Uh -huh. I need a ball of Play-Doh. Shape it around my finger. Use some flesh-colored paint to blend it in. Carefully make a small cut in the Play-Doh. Add some fake blood. A horrible, gory finger. Perfect. Time to work out. This is too easy. <sighs> Limp Womp. Better watch out for monsters. And in one, one thousand and two. Ah! My finger! Ah! Y your finger! Oh, it's so sore. Help me, please. Don't panic. I know for sure. Okay, I'm here to help. What the? It's fake. Fooled you. Now we're <laughs> even. <laughs> That's not funny. This song is great, right? Here, here we start back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to the party, ladies. Hey, I brought you a drink. Uh, what the heck? She just butt it in. I can't believe she just poached that guy from me. Bringing him a drink. Ugh. Huh. Look at these octopuses. Yeah. I think I need to do something about this. Okay. I'm gonna need some makeup clay. I'll flatten it and then wrap it around my thumb. I'll squeeze it around to make a point. And then I'll smooth it all out. Okay. That looks pretty good. Now I need to add these little circles. I'll add them across the whole length. That should be enough. Now for some color. I'll use a brush to make it this purpley color. So, it looks like it matches my skin tone. It looks great! I'll do it for all my fingers! Yes! This is amazing! All right, time to set my plan in motion. There they are. Still having a good time, I guess. Oh, looks like he's leaving. Now's my chance. I'm gonna teach her a lesson. Guess who? Huh? 
Where'd she go? Oh, she had to leave, but I don't mind. Where is she? I'm so excited for this Halloween party! <sighs> don't you wanna go on in? I'm still waiting for someone. Aw, oh, man. His cookie costume is so fun! Hey! Sorry I'm late! What are you wearing? Ugh. Well, I guess we can finally go in. Hold it. Well, you can go in, but not her. Sorry, babe. What? He abandoned me! <laughs> and now my makeup is running too! I'm gonna have to do something about this. I'll clean off all my makeup. I'll put this tissue on my cheek and then wet it. There. It'll stick on its own now. Just gotta make sure it all gets wet. Okay. And now I'll make a tear straight down from my eye. And then I'll fold it over a bit on the edges. There. That should be good enough. Now I'll use some makeup glue. I'll dab it over the edges and the tissue. And a little bit on my skin, too. Okay, that should be enough. Now I'll dry it with a hair dryer. Nice and warm. Okay, it's dry now. Next up, makeup time. I want to use a foundation that matches my skin tone. Because obviously I want to hide the tissue. So it looks like my actual skin. It'll take a little bit of work, but it's worth it. Especially because I want it to look as realistic as possible. Okay, now for some setting powder. Ooh, look at it pop everywhere! I love it! Now I'll add it over the foundation. It looks so good! Now to add some fake blood. I'll put it all inside the triangle shape I created. I'll just dab it around up to the edges. Ooh, so cool! Now to dab with a sponge. Done! One side of my face I'm normal. And the other side is super scary! The creepy contact really helps sell the look, too. No one will abandon me now! Oh my gosh! Oh, you startled me! You're, um, you're free to go in. Finally! I made it inside the Halloween party! Oh, wow! Look at her! Hey! She made it inside! Hey! Hey, nothing. See you later. Bang, bang! Take that! Happy Halloween, sweetie. Can you help me with these decorations? Oh, yes, mommy. I'd love to. Okay, scary skeleton, you go there. Mommy! These cobwebs are attacking me! Terrifying toilet paper! Yeah! A frightening face and balloons! Oh, Careful! Oops! Oh, I got it, darling. Are you okay? Finished, mommy! Ta-da! Oh, thank you, honey. Go play with your robot. I know what to do with this. Peel the skin from the watermelon. Carefully cut some grooves into it. Making sure you go all the way around. Put in a large bowl with some fake eyes and finally pour in some soda. And then you have a floating brain in a jar. Oh, honey. Want some brain juice? Yummy, yummy. Mmm. It's time for a makeover. How do I look? Ha, no way! That's hilarious! I love this channel. What was that? Ew! Are you done? Can I finish my cereal? Are you kidding me? That was scary! I think you need to work on it. There's no need to be rude. I'll show you. I suppose I better get ready. I'll start with my eyeliner. Ah! Look at this! 
Really? That's the best you've got? There's a knife! In my head! Come on! I'll never be able to scare Gabby. What am I gonna do? Hang on. These cotton swabs give me an idea. I think I can use these. First, I'll remove the cotton. Then I'll cut the plastic rod in half. I'll melt the end of the plastic using a candle. This'll help soften it. I'll press it against the table to make a flat edge. Now I'll spray them silver. Time for the fun part! Oh no! I'm bald! Just kidding. But I need to cover my hair. I'm gonna use this white face paint. I'll apply it using a makeup brush. I'll start by covering my cheeks. And then work around my face. I don't want to miss any spots. You might need a friend for the next part. Put the face paint over the bald cap and the back of your head. Okay, what's next? Oh, I know! I'm wearing black contact lenses and put black lipstick on. Now I need red face paint. I'll use a small makeup brush to create a thin line down the center of my face. Then I'll add some more. Next, I'll draw some horizontal lines. I work on one side first, then join up the other side. Can't forget my head! Now I can stick on the plastic rod. I've added fake blood to the bottom of them. It completes the look. I just need the rest of my costume. If this doesn't scare Gabby, nothing will. <sighs> Home at last. It's been a busy day. I'm gonna put my feet up and watch TV. What happened in here? Ashley? Are you? Huh? Welcome home! <laughs> ah! Stay back! I mean it! You're mine, Gabby! Let me out! Let me out! I think I've got everything for the Halloween party. I want it to be perfect. I'm so excited! Wait. What was that? Gabby? Eh, uh, you got me. What were you doing back there? What do you think of my costume? Pretty scary, huh? Hmm, it's a little basic. Really? I like it. I worked hard on it. Look at this. This is a Halloween costume. You need a change. Right now. But… fine. Where was I? Oh yeah, the soda. Happy Halloween! Let's party! Girls, you're here! Woohoo! Wow, you all look amazing! Wow, what a creepy demon hand. I know, I love it. I can't believe Ashley said that! Ugh! She thinks she's so clever. Great, now I need to clean up. Could this get any worse? Wait, I think I have an idea. A scary idea. First, I need some latex. I'll pour it into a bowl. I'll use a makeup sponge to apply it. I want to dab it on one side of my face. Just like this. And then across my forehead. That should do it. Next, I need the oats. I'll press them onto the latex. It doesn't need to be perfect. It'll add to the desired texture. That's enough. Now I'll add more latex on top of the oats. I want to hold them in place. Now I need some tissue paper. I'll tear it in half. Then press it onto my skin. I'll just move it into position. That looks about right. I need my foundation makeup. I'll put it over the oats to match my skin tone. I'll do the same with the tissue paper. I want to cover it completely. It's time for some black face paint! I'm gonna apply this around my eyes. I'll start with the lower eyelid. And then the top. It beats wearing eyeshadow. Now we need to make it look gory. That's why I have fake blood. I'll brush it over the oats. And along the edge of the tissue paper. The fake blood will settle in between the oats. It'll make it look like an open and raw wound. It's gonna look pretty gruesome. The dripping blood just adds to the effect. I think I'm ready. I think it's time to show Ashley. <laughs> and then Kevin said that he liked my demon horns. He's such a flirt. He might swing by later. Here goes. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Ah, look at that! Ah! It's terrifying! I can't look! I hate this party! You can't tell, but I'm so scared! <laughs> gotcha! You were so scared! Gabby? Whoa, that is amazing! Girls, come back! I made it myself! We need to take a picture! Smile! Nah, nah. But, but, ugh! Gabby! I want to be the popular one! Mmm, I'm gonna enjoy this! Oh, it's so good. That was delicious. I wish I had another. Hmm, I think there's something stuck in my teeth. Maybe it's not noticeable? I better do something about this. 
Ooh, toothpicks. They'll do the job. Let's get rid of this food. Ugh, that didn't work. Let's try this again. Almost. Wow, it's really wedged in there. What the? I look like a porcupine! How long have you been standing there? Watch where you're throwing these! Clean this up, or else! Uh, sure, mom. Wow, she was really mad. Ouch, that hurt! Oh my gosh, that's not good! Ouch! Stupid toothpick. I have a great idea. I'll cut one end from the toothpick. Now I'll flip it around and color it with a black marker pen. Next, I need a piece of paper and my trusty glue gun. I'll put a small blob of glue onto the paper and press the toothpick into it. I'll do the same with the others. Now I need some latex. I'll use a makeup sponge to apply it to my skin. I'll put the latex over my cheek, making sure it's nice and even. Then I'll take one of the toothpicks and press it onto my cheek. The latex will hold it in place. Let's add the rest. That should do it. I need some red face paint. I'll brush it over the latex. I want to cover it and the glue at the bottom of the toothpick. It'll make it look like a sore wound. Once that's done, I need fake blood. I'll use a brush to apply it. Again, I'll put it around the bottom of the toothpick. It's starting to look gory. I can let it drip down my cheek. It makes it look real. I can do the same on my hand. It's pretty gross, huh? Shh, don't tell mom. Hey, mom! Here she comes. What is it now? Oh no! Your hand! What happened? My poor baby girl! We need to get you to the hospital! Mom, you gotta do something! <laughs> Look at this! Oh, oh my gosh! It's so sore! I can't do this. Mom? Are you okay? Mom? Wake up! Oh, wh what happened? Hold on. Is this a prank? Gabby, you're in so much trouble! I better get to class. But I need to grab something from my locker first. Hi, Ashley. What the? Man, you're so creepy. Some would say it's endearing. Nope. Definitely creepy. That was so weird. Seriously. Love you. Uh, yeah. Sure. How did he get here so fast? And why is it always the nerds that fall in love with me? What? Where did these come from? Was this you? Something sweet for my sweetie. I hope you think of me when you eat them. I'm more likely to throw up. Are you kidding me? Chris, this is graffiti! It's art. A masterpiece. I want the world to know about our love. I can't deal with this anymore! Call me! Skipping class, huh? She's my dream woman. I can't escape him! He's everywhere! All that running has made me thirsty. <sighs> That's better. There you are. I like these silly games we play. No, it can't be! Wow, I'm never washing again. In some cultures, that means we're practically married. Do you want to kiss the groom? <laughs> ah, why do I have to be so adorable? Time for a new look. First, I need to apply latex to my face. I'll apply it around my mouth. It's easier to use a makeup sponge for this. Now I'll stick a piece of tissue paper over my mouth. Next, I need my makeup. I'm using foundation to match my skin. I'll dab the sponge over the tissue paper. I want to cover it fully. It's gonna be hard to talk. So let's cut a hole in the tissue paper. I'll fold the tissue paper down, revealing my lips. That's better. Now I need black face paint. I'll use this to color my lips. This is gonna look great! I'll let that dry. And then I need this ribbon. I've cut small holes in the tissue paper. This lets me thread the ribbon through it. My lips are sealed. Now for the finishing touches. I'll paint fake blood around the ribbon. It looks like it's going through my skin. It's pretty gross. I can use a large sponge now. I'll dab it over my chin and around my mouth. This will help mask the foundation and tissue paper. And make it more frightening. I wonder if Chris will kiss me now. You better put your glasses on. Thanks. Wait. Come on, Chris. Kiss me. Ah! Mommy, save me! Aw, you don't want to kiss me? Phew, that was close. Woohoo, let's party! Huh? That is one big gift. I wonder what it is. I've been waiting for you, Ava. And I'm really hungry. 
knew Ava wouldn't be able to resist. <laughs> I'm so excited! It's Halloween, my favorite day of the year! I need to get everything ready. Ooh, spooky. These pumpkins will be perfect here. What do you think? What? Oh, I feel so bad. I hate being ill. There's so much snot. Don't worry, I know what to do. I'll have you feeling better in no time. Ooh, Huggy Wuggy will cheer you up. No, you won't. How about I pull the snot out? No. Hmm, let's take your temperature. Ow! Okay, that's not good. I guess there's only one thing for it. We need professional help. Hello, doctor? I need your help. You rang? <laughs> Where is the victim? I mean, patient. I have work to do. Good luck! I I'm gonna sit over there. That doctor is intense! Uh, hey. I need to examine you. Will I be okay? No, I'm afraid not. Not when I'm finished with you. <sighs> Don't move. A terrifying look is easy to achieve. First, I'll start with my eyes. I'll apply eyeshadow and eyeliner. It looks pretty glamorous. Now for some mascara. It's time to go from glamour to gore. I'll use a makeup pencil to create an outline. Next, I'll use black face paint to fill it in. Just make sure to stay in the lines. I need to cover my lips fully. Now I'll stick tissue paper around the mouth. I'm using glue to hold it in place. I've built up the layers around my mouth and chin. Next, it's time for the teeth. Or should I say, fake nails. Simply press them into the tissue paper and glue. Keep the teeth spaced out. This means you have room for the bottom teeth. You won't need a lot. Once you've done that, it's time to cover it up. I'm using foundation to match my skin tone. Dab it over the tissue paper to blend it. Now we need some fake blood. Brush it around the edges of the mouth and teeth. A smaller brush is perfect for this. Don't miss any spots. We want this to look convincing. Next, take a makeup sponge and a small amount of fake blood. Use the sponge to go around the outside of the tissue paper. This will just add the finishing touches. And cover any obvious makeup. Apply it to your cheeks and your throat. You don't need a lot. We just want it to look scary. There's one last thing to do. I'll add a few more drops of blood. I'll brush it down my throat. That's the gory part finished. All that's left to do is get into your costume. That looks amazing. Or should I say, terrifying. Did someone ask for a doctor? You know, I'm good. It was a false alarm. I I've gotta go. Uh, what's her problem? Don't look at me. At least she's feeling better. And I'll say the magic word, abracadabra! Is this your card? How do I look? Mm, I'm not sure I suit a tail. Is this too much pink? I look like a marshmallow. Everybody loves bananas, right? Nope, I look ridiculous. I like the banana. I'm never gonna find a costume to wear. Maybe this'll cheer you up. What? What's going on? Don't take your eyes off the cards. And hey presto! Ouch! Why did you do that? Wow, that's actually quite impressive. Wait, that gives me an idea. Let's do this. I'll start by applying white face paint. I'll go cover all of my face. I'll take my time. I want this to be perfect. It tickles my nose. I'll paint my eyebrows too. And then down my neckline. You may need help for this part. I'll paint the top of my chest too. Now I can use a makeup sponge to even it out. This will ensure an even application. This is looking good. Now I need a red eyeliner pencil. And I'll put black eyeshadow on. This will create a great effect. It really contrasts the white makeup. It can be lighter the further out from the eyes. Next, let's try some contouring. I'll dab the brush along my cheekbones. It'll make them stand out. Time for some lip liner. This is such a vibrant red. I wear this on a night out. I'll paint faint lines on my face. These will be scar lines. Then I'll apply a tattoo transfer. Aw, the star is cute. Transfers look great and are pain free. Something's missing. That's more like it. I'm the clown prince of crime. Let's have some fun. I'm missing my little monster. I've put white face paint on this makeup sponge. I'll dab it lightly over my face. It doesn't need to be a thick layer of makeup. I'll put red eyeshadow on my right eye. And blue on the left. 
Now I need to smear them. Just like this. It needs a little sparkle. Glitter eyeshadow is perfect for this. I'll put some on the smears as well. Then I'll put on false eyelashes. And paint on a love heart. And a rotten tattoo. My lipstick doesn't need to be perfect. In fact, the messier it is, the better. I'll smear this too. Now I need some prop. I look cute. Wait until they get a load of me. What are you looking at? We make a great couple. We sure do, Puddin. Let's cause some mischief. You read my mind. You know how to treat a girl, Joker. Mwah! You know the worst thing about Halloween? There's too many bats. Let's get out of here. <laughs> I love trick-or-treating. Well, I love all the yummy candy. Trick-or-treat! Who dares to knock on Dracula's door? Ha, kidding! Huh? What are you supposed to be? Uh, I'm a princess. That's not very scary, is it? I'm a little disappointed. Have a lollipop. Seriously? That's it? Honey, it's Halloween. I expect to be frightened. But you're mean. I can't believe I only got a lollipop. It's so unfair. I like my costume. Hang on. I have an idea. I'll cut a love heart shape from some cardboard. Now I'll apply glue around the edges. I need to work quick. I'll fold cardboard around the shape to make a border. I need to press it into the glue. I'll put more glue on that. I'm glad I've got a steady hand. Now I can put another heart shape on top. Next, I'll cover the top with glue. Spread the glue out liberally. It needs to cover the whole area. Stick glue fabric to the cardboard. Slide it into position. Do this on both sides. Turn the cardboard onto its side. And add more glue. Just like this. And stick more fabric to it. Smooth it out so there are no creases or wrinkles. This is the last piece. It's so soft. But I'm not finished. Cut two circles from a piece of foam. Then add two smaller black circles. Use black fabric for a mouth. Then cut foam in the same shape. Use a scalpel to cut teeth into the foam. What a lovely smile. Now I need to stick the lips on. And my new costume is ready. <laughs> Let's try it on. Trick or treat. Again. Ooh, what do we have here? Where did they go? Hey. <laughs> uh, what was that? Hello, friend. Let's play a game. Uh, no thanks. I don't want to. It'll be Is something wrong? I thought you liked to be scared. <laughs> what a great costume. Look at all this candy. I love Halloween. Look at the size of this pumpkin. I have big plans for it. It's gonna be the scariest jack-o'-lantern ever. There's something so relaxing about this. This'll be the eyes. Now for the nose. And of course, the scary snarling mouth. Okay, how's it looking? Uh, it's not quite how I imagined it. Let's try it again. How's that? That's one mean-looking pumpkin! La 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 la! Ava! Boo! Sh la 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 la! Oh yeah! Nothing? No reaction at all? Hey, over here! Bleh, boo! What the? Oh my gosh, that's so funny! What are you doing? What do you mean? I'm being scary! Well, that didn't go to plan. I feel ridiculous now. Uh-oh. I might have a problem. <gasps> I know what to do! I'll pull it off! Ow! Ouch! Stop it! I'll get you out of there! It hurts! It's not budging! <sighs> I'm sorry, Lexi. It looks like you're gonna have a pumpkin for a head. This is the worst. I just wanted to prank Ava. And now I look like a scarecrow. Does anyone else smell pumpkin? No? Just me? It's so hard to see out of this. Life as a pumpkin is tough. This is your life now. Unless… I'll be right back. Check this out! We're pumpkin buddies! You mean it? Aw, thanks, Ava! Oh yeah! Let's party! 
this isn't so bad. You're the best friend a pumpkin could ever have. <laughs> Drinks and chips are ready. I just need to put this somewhere. Hmm, where should this go? I know. I'll hang this ghost here. A tarantula on the wall. That's it. Let's party. The toilet isn't really spooky. Let's make it more scary. Phew! Done! Oh, hey guys! Thanks for coming! Ooh, I drank the soda too fast. I need the toilet. Spooky bathroom. I really gotta pee. What the? Ah! Oh, come on. My jeans and sneakers are all wet. What am I going to do? Well, I suppose I need to wear something. Great party! Oh my, what are you wearing? I should have shaved my legs before I came out tonight. <laughs> hey, I love this song! Let's party! Wanna make a splash this Halloween? Use black body paint to fill in. That shape around your lips. Now for the glue mixture. Pour some Elmer's glue into a bowl. Then add a bit of flour. Tear up pieces of toilet paper. Now mix it all together. Apply it all around the bottom of your face. The thick texture makes all the difference. Have a fake nail lying around? Cut it to look like this. Get some paint handy and use a sponge to gently color the nail. See how they blend together? Perfect! Now it's time to turn them into teeth. They stick right underneath the glue. Now use foundation to blend things in a bit better. Can't forget to make some lips. Yep, all the way around. Then dab your cheeks with fake blood on a sponge. You can never have enough blood, right? And just like that, you're a surgeon gone wrong. Chilling! Check out this awesome party! Woohoo! Wow! His costume is awesome! I could use a doctor's visit! I'm so going over there! Hey there! Great costume! That's only half of it. You scared of a few teeth? <laughs> Scaredy cat. This story's sad. I could use some digital company. 
Nobody's even online? I feel so alone. Now what do I do? Oh. Check out this girl. How is she doing this to her hair? I want to look just like my doll. And it all starts with the brows. Don't forget to fill them all in. Then comes some shimmery shadow. Bring it all the way up to the lid. Blend it all. Then add some white to your waterline. Actually, a little thicker than that. Look at that gorgeous glow! Then add a brown to add dimension. Then blend, of course. See how nicely it goes together? But we're not done yet. Line that eye with a black liner. Then add a little bit on the bottom. Then add some lines going this way. See how they look like eyelashes? Time for a good old-fashioned contour. Now bring out that beauty blender. Keep going! Now add some rouge to your cheeks. Ta-da! Now line the lips, but not too harsh. Then blend in a nice rosy color. Mwah! Pull out the corners with this effect. Now is where you really start looking like a doll. Aw, so cute! All done! This living doll ought to get some attention! Oh, hello there! Shall we start streaming now? This will definitely be more fun to watch! Uh. More coffee, sweetheart? Cheryl? Is she asleep? Maybe she needs a little wind-up. Wakey-wakey! Oh! Thanks for the help! Now I can move! And look at all these people watching! Now we're talking! Wave hi!